Hello world. My name is Drexel the Penguin. I have taken over Polar Bear's YouTube account to say that I am, without question, the most homosexual bird in the entire multiverse, and if any other birds claim they are the gayest, including a certain penguin whose name starts with a letter H, they are of course wrong, and if they say that I'm wrong, I will challenge them to a boxing match like who hole. Only nobody ever meets me to join the boxing matches I hold. The only one who showed up to my boxing match was Sunny the Bird who whipped my ass so hard it was broken for 69 days. I remember it sounded like I'm cuckoo for feces. I know you're asking me, hey Pretzel the Penguin, how did I take over Poe's account? It was easy really. He forgot to lock his front door and log out of his computer when he ventured to the cloning lab. So I walked in and got into his Yoshi account. You may be wondering why they call me Pretzel the Penguin. They call me Pretzel the Penguin because I was known in the Arctic for my famous penis-shaped pretzels. You could get them in only the chewy red form because I don't know how the crunchy small ones are made. People could get them with the following additions, penis pepperoni with dick cheese and anal blood sauce on the side, one with an actual, chopped off penis from the nearest husky, stuffed inside the pretzel, jalapenos, and of course, salty walls, for those who want only a snack. Don't forget the creamy melty cum sauce for dipping. My penis pretzel sold like hot gay pornos for about a month. Soon after the successful month, I was forced to shut down my business after a lawsuit case claiming I ripped off penis spread the clown's famous pretzel model of penis spread. How the hell was I supposed to know that he came, uh, came up with penis pretzels first? I never got word about it because A, I have no fucking devices and B, even if I had one there's no internet in the fucking Antarctic so I still wouldn't know. After that mess, I fell into a depressed state and I lost my creative edge. I'm not depressed right now because I found myself another cash cow. Icicle penises. No, 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 no. Icicle penises. They're not only useful for snacking on, being used as dildos, and sucking on, but they also cool your drink, cool yourself, and cool any part of your body. Get them down before they melt. Even if they do melt, the water would be useful for having a melted enema. Oh! Warning, this item is prohibited for use by the pube muppet or any member of the pubic family. I'm selling loads of them right now during this summer season and so far I haven't seen anybody sue my ass for allegedly copying their ideas. Even if they did, I'm betting they didn't know that I thought of it first, so I should get all the credit for making them and not those steel investors. Enough about my business, let me talk about something else. I may be the gayest bird dick in the universe, omniverse, multiverse, and beyond, but I am not the gayest organism. That role currently goes to Barney. I am working on trying to be gayer than Barney and claim the title of gayest organism to teach that faggot for being a star who investor. Marty, if you're watching this, you'd better quit your act because I'm about to dethrone your ass one day. There is no point in me being the gayest man, because if you haven't noticed by now, I'm a fucking penguin, therefore I cannot be the gayest man, because I am not a man. Okay? Uh? I think I said everything. I have to go now, because I'm about to pitch my icicle penises business to Shark Tank, in hopes of increasing sales and avoiding any potential bullshit lawsuits. Goodbye.